A tall ship's Erie officially kicks off today with some of those ships already arriving in Erie. Crews of those ships are busy getting ready for the thousands of visitors expected over this four-day festival. This is coverage of Tall Ships Erie. Fontaine Glenn joining us now from the Bayfront with more on this weekend's exciting events. Good morning, Fontaine. Good morning, Dave. Yes, Tall Ships Erie has returned to Erie and it kicks off later today. And we're going to talk about one of the ships that you can see is the Appledore. Talk more about the Appledore is Captain Matt and Chief Mate Red. Good morning, guys. Good morning. So tell me a little more about the Appledore. I know uh, last half hour we talked about it, but tell me again more about the Appledore. Yeah, so she's a two-masted gaff rig schooner. Um, it's a reinforced steel hull, so she can handle just about anything you throw her away. Yeah. And Chief Mate Red, tell me what you do as Chief Mate on the Appledore. So as Chief Mate, I run the deck. I yell out the orders to the crew and have them raise the sails, coil lines, anything I want them to do. Um, and then any safety standards, uh, I just make sure everyone's safe on board and that we follow all the procedures necessary. Awesome. And we were talking about the different legs, so tell me a little bit about the differences. I didn't realize there was many differences, but we were talking about them. There sounds like a lot. Yeah, between all five gray lakes. Yeah. yeah, so they all have their interesting little quirks or uh, differences. Um, Erie is fun and challenging to sail in. Um, it's a it's a long and narrow lake that you know basically runs southwest to northeast, mm -hmm. and uh, because it's so shallow, uh, she can get really wavy. Um, so it's it's a lot of fun to to navigate through her. Yeah, you want to add anything to it? Yeah, and so. People will be able to ride the Apple Door, so there's some education purposes you guys will be talking about too. Uh, absolutely, yeah. So the we're a nonprofit organization, uh, Bay Sail is. Uh, so typically we do uh, educational and environmental type things, uh, like. Uh, this weekend when you ride on Appledore, we're happy to answer any, you know, ship or boating questions that you have. Um, and we have a, a tendency to, you know, talk about our history a little bit. Yeah. I'm going to put you on the spot. Tell me one unique fact about the Appledore. One unique fact about the Appledore. Um, so she has uh, a, a custom designed chine. So that's the, the bow or the front part of the boat um, that is made to be a, an icebreaker. So she can uh, allegedly break through about three feet of ice. Awesome. Well, it's going to be a fun weekend, I think, and thankfully we're not in Antarctica or there's no ice out there. there so thank you guys so much for joining us. And as always, you can find all the list of the events right on our website, yourerie.com. Dave, back to you. Lots going on. Thank you, Fontaine.